of Sonic Colors Rise of the Wisps, which just came out today, just a few minutes ago at the time of this recording. So, obviously, you know, I was uh, a little bit hyped for it ever since the Sonic Central. And so it looks like this is a pretty lengthy animation for an animation with complete voice dialogue. Six minutes? Uh, so we will see what happens here. Sonic Colors Rise of the Wisps. Just by a cute little Directed by Tyson Hess. just like, into the story, and then that egghead impression took me right out of it. Okay, then. Would you like to read Eggman's lines? What? No, no, no. I mean, if you insist. <clears throat> I've been practicing, you know. Ho, 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 ho. You see, once each of these alien drainers is filled to the brim, I'll have enough energy to power a whole army of my stupid machines. Of course, I'd have more if you hadn't dropped so many capsules. But I guess that's the most I can expect from the garbage I invent. Uh, Sonic? Sonic? Where? No, oh, he's gonna kick my butt! Sonic, would you like to stop ad-libbing, please? Just read what the translator says. Well, the direct translation was a little dry, okay? Uh -huh. I'm just spicing it up. This poor Jade Wisp is telling us her tragic story. Let's be respectful. Ugh, fine. Hey, Jade, feel free to throw in a joke or a car chase or something to keep it interesting. Sorry. Please continue. Eggman left right after that. He hopped into a cool car with flames on the side and drifted away. But then it exploded. And then suddenly a dinosaur appeared. Whoa, really? Wait. You're just making it more interesting for me, aren't you? <laughs> but before he left, he put another robot in charge of the others. He called him... Oh, no. Damn, Sonic, sir. What happened? Good, great, awesome. awesome. Honor it is to work with an outstanding, outstanding marvel of engineering such as yourself. Amazing! amazing. <sighs> Pay him no mind. His voice chip has been on the fritz, you see. Rocket! Now, is there anything we can do to make your time with us more pleasant? Ah, yes, of course. Our jobs. We've just got to get these wisps processed and shipped out across the planet. And Eggman asked very sternly that we not do it like complete bumbling imbeciles. But don't you worry. Big bro? Can I call you big bro? Anyway, we aren't bumbling at all, are we, Cubot?
didn't hear was where I can find these creeps and aggressively recycle them. I can lead you right to them. Great. I have a zero tolerance policy on bullies. We'll save your friends. Just please, no more stories. Now let's get going. Which isn't a bad thing, but it just takes more so I can change where the group will feature a lot more. So, yeah, there's that. Overall, it was fine. I just expect part two to be, yeah, just better. Alright, so, uh, yeah, that's my reaction to, uh, Part one, like I said just now, it's it, it's it's all right. I just wish that the Sonic and Tails were more prominently featured than the Wisps, because most of that took place in Eggman's uh, at Eggman's like lab where they capture the Wisps. But uh, that's that's normally my only big issue with the with the episode. Overall, I just think that it's an eh episode. So hopefully part two will be better. I don't know when that will release. But I hope it comes out within like a month or two. So yeah, that's uh, that's all for that. Hope you guys enjoyed. And I will see you all soon. Peace.